Hey everybody, what is going on? Fallout here, and today I am going to talk you through how to set up the new cross-save feature in Destiny 2. So first things first, if you haven't done this already, you have to go to the Bungie.net website and link your Steam account if you have one. As of right now, August 21st, uh, Destiny 2 is not on Steam yet. That doesn't happen until October. So even though we're talking about cross-save today, if you plan on playing D2 on PC at all between now and October 1st, that is going to happen on Blizzard. But again, for getting cross-save set up, you might as well just uh, link your Steam account now because it is part of the process. Might as well get it out of the way right now. Okay, so after you have gone to Bungie.net and after you have linked your Steam account for October, you can click in the top right area on your profile picture and on the drop-down menu, you can go to the new icon that says cross-save. I know some of you might be gun-shy about logging in because it's like, oh, did I log in on the right account? I want to make sure the right guardians of mine get enabled for cross-save. You don't really need to worry about that. Bungie actually did a really good job of making this entire process pretty user-friendly. So yeah, you click on cross-save, you have to agree to the user agreement, and then it is going to take you to this next page where you have to authenticate all of your accounts. Basically, if you own an Xbox, if you own a PlayStation, every platform that you have access to, if you want to use your D2 Guardians on that platform, you have to confirm that, yeah, you are on those platforms. You have to authenticate every account you have under one roof. This is really as easy as just clicking authenticate now, Bungie has confirmed over their Twitter account that a lot of people, myself included, were having a lot of trouble with the authentication process. Every now and then there's like a glitch that happens that you try to authenticate, and when you authenticate one account, another account will de-authenticate and it goes back and forth like you're playing a game of friggin' whack-a-mole. Again, if that is happening to you, do not panic. You are not alone. There is a ton of people this is happening to. It happened to my fiance. It happened to me, happening to a jillion people on Twitter. To get around that, uh, you either need to be patient and wait until Bungie gets all of their crap straightened out, or you can do what I did, which I don't know if it's going to work for 100% of the people out there, but it worked for me. Really hot tip on this one from my good friend Cool Guy. Really hot tip. Tip so hot they call it the devil's foreskin. Here's what you do. Open up Google Chrome and activate incognito mode. I know that all of you out there are familiar with incognito mode, you degenerates. So open it that way, try the process again, and hopefully it worked for you. It worked for me, the one and only time I tried to do it in incognito mode. When you finally get past that part, you will be on step three, where Bungie will ask you to choose your active characters. Again, these are the characters who are going to be available on any platform that you have ownership of. So that should be pretty easy. I mean, I know for me, I know exactly which Guardians I wanted to play on every platform, so I picked them, and then you can just move on from step three. It is much easier than I thought it would be. Also, from what I understand, you can deactivate cross-save at any time, although I think there is a 90-day penalty to have cross-save re-enabled, but if you wanted to, you can deactivate it, I think, at any time. Finally, they are going to ask you to review your setup. You just have to look everything over and make sure it all looks good, and then hit yes, do it at the bottom, that gold button, and that is it. Everything is done. You now have cross-save set up. Really, the hardest part in all of that was getting past the uh, authentication, but hopefully if you're watching this video late tonight on August 21st, hopefully Bungie has gotten all that garbage sorted out already. But again, if you're having trouble with it, try incognito mode. I don't know about you, but it worked for me. Anyway, that is it. Enjoy cross-save. I know I will. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Thank <laughs> you.